Okay. So what we've got here is a motor glider wing that's uh, got dropped about nine inches off the trestle and initially we concentrated on looking at the crash damage which you can see on the leading edge of the inboard rib. Subsequent to that, bearing in mind it only dropped nine inches off the trestle onto its nose, we now have, I'm going to get my friend here to flex the wing tip, a crack that runs all the way forward from the inboard hinge all the way forward to the spar, which will probably have to go past the spar to, so we can check the leading edge of the spar. But if you look at that amount of flex, can you flex it again? Close up. Look at that. And if we go around the other side, smile, you're on camera. Uh, you can see just in front of the hinge here, see it opening and closing. And what it's also done inside there, I'll just get my finger and point, just here, you can see it split the rib all the way down to, visibly down to about there. So the question is, is there any more? One small ground handling slip.